Hi everybody, it's Sasa Captain's another flower tutorial again guys. I know right, I've been crazy huh? I did not plan making this flower. I was making was um when I did live show earlier today. I just talked this with Jenny like uh what am I going to do? What we're talking about, you know. I I told a lot of stuff and I found this material, you know. I bought like long, long time ago. Thought about you know making flower. I never have a chance to do it, you know. But I'm gonna show you guys first. Isn't that pretty? I love it. This is my favorite colors. Isn't that pretty? I just love this. Look at this. And isn't that pretty? It's just so pink. And this is different pink. And this is the green one. I know it's it's oh, and the different green. Is that pretty? This is another one. So this is actually is a from material is this. It the non slit liner so it's 12 inches by 5 feet it's quite a lot so I got this at Dollar Tree so you guys can buy this at Dollar Store so only a dollar so Dollar Tree so that I use right and and you had acrylic paint. At first when I did on my live show, I did like experiment try different ink. It's not working, but oh, only the acrylic paint is working. So let me, let's start with the uh, tutorial, shall we? So what is it? Very easy and super fast. So what am I going to do? I actually start cutting strip like it. I actually eyeball measuring this okay so I actually just fold like this and see so that's it um let me see just how big you want you um flower going to be so this is let me see is about two and three quarter it's about two and three quarter so I we need like five petals So I did it in the front of TV, so it's no problem with me. So again, I did thread this one. This probably, let's see how the width is uh, seven eight, and this is really cheap to make, huh? Only the expensive is the center flower center guy. Okay? I'm glad I did the uh, um, flower tutorial because Karen suggests about binding the uh, limestone to make the flower center like this. Just the trim and wrap around is cheaper than just by the buckle. Buckle is expensive, so. Now after I got these right, so I actually, well I I did, you know, trim both sides. But I figure I always trim like not even. So I figure if I fold like this and fold this again, like this, and the one is you just trim it like that angle. I can see what I'm trimming. Yep. See, now you get a loop pattern like that. 
I just trim that one up a little bit. See what will end up your pattern like this. So we do all the five leaves. doesn't take that long to make one though especially when you uh, sit in front of the TV I always telling you guys to um, making something in front of the TV so you don't feel like you With the time or spend too much time crafting. Okay, and now you get five petals, right? And we're gonna paint. So the all the color that I use is pretty much for our paint. So this one is sunny yellow. So this is kind of different color. So I'm gonna use this. I don't think I have used this. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna use that. And I figure when I use um, the paper towel underneath this, it's kind of actually dry faster than um, I use it. It is uh, I cheat some stuff, but it's not dry faster. So, but this one is dry faster for me, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna move it. I look it up further there so I don't get the mess so I mean uh, messy so I'm gonna get all my powder that I'm gonna use the paintbrush and I'm gonna use my tweezers to help me to hold the powder down so I don't use my so I don't get my hand messy so we're going to start paint this is yep this really really yellow than those two so this uh, make sure that um you don't trim later i figure after you paint this if you didn't cover all the white if you trim it later it will see um the real net um the white color of this So um, I just want to make sure it's on the side. On the side, I paint it and turn over. Well, the light color it doesn't show, but the dark color some of these. If you not paint all around, it will show white spot. Okay guys, I'm back. So this one is dry. It doesn't take that long to let air dry, but it's so done heated. Okay guys, so it's, it's, it, you know, it's soft plastic. So what you want to do is grab this hole and make it look like this petal. And you a little bit of there is tiny hot glue
That's all my petal. <clears throat> I told you before, if you decide to chip, cut, trim this off the edge there, it might be too sharp. Um, they will see the white, the real colors, so you have to paint it cover again. But I'm not going to. <laughs> so I'm going to use my one inch sucker punch here. And yeah, we'll start. Put this one right there. And what I like to do, like um, light them up for make sure this one will. See what I like to do, make sure this will fit in there. It's not really overlap though guys because I trim on both sides of you know what I mean? Both this side. So you can layer if you want like a thicker boggy but I like this the flat look like this guy. Okay. That blue is my favorite color. <clears throat> and now you can use any flower center that you want. I have this same with that. And I have Different buckle, I mean the fold like that. Or I can use this limestone buckle and with the half rows there. Okay. So I'm going to use this. I'm going to use tweezer here to help. go it's not pretty guys <laughs> I love this I told you this uh, blue is my favorite isn't that pretty <laughs> I just love this guys silly I do <clears throat> okay guys that's it if you guys like my video guys please leave your comment and give me a thumb up so I'll try to make more uh, flower to share okay thank you guys that's it for watching and i will see you guys later bye bye